Hi everyone, it's Miss Lala. I'm here to talk about painting and drawing with you today. We are going to be doing one session a week where you watch me paint and draw and maybe you can follow along at home. But first, let's get our hands warmed up for our class. Okay, here we go. Give yourselves a round of applause. Good job. And what comes after that? Did you say three deep breaths? You got it. Here we go. Remember, no touching our faces. We're just gonna go like this. And one. for creativity. Let's get started. Okay, so we're gonna go over color mixing today. Um, this is one of my favorite things to do in art. We talked about three primary colors all the way back in the beginning of the year. They are red, yellow, and blue. And they come from the earth. Um, they're from minerals. So you can't mix red, yellow, or blue. They just are the primary colors. And from those three colors, that's it. You make the whole rainbow, mind blown, including black and brown. Now, once you start adding white, gray, and black to these three colors, you remember, it's called what? Light to dark. It's called value. But today we're just gonna concentrate on the three primary colors and mixing them into secondary colors. And then this is a big word, tertiary colors. And then we'll also do some browns from the complementary colors. Okay, let's get started. So let's get to color mixing. We're gonna use three colors today, red, blue, and yellow. We're also gonna look over the color wheel because that makes it so easy to figure out your next steps. So I'll put this down here. This is our color wheel. Red will go here, yellow will go here, and blue will go here. Let's start with red first. Now this doesn't have to be perfect. You just wanna kind of get some paint on there. Red. Then let's do yellow. Last one, 
What's the last color? What's this? primary colors on our color wheel and now this is where the magic happens in between red and yellow is the answer to what it mixes to what do red and yellow mix together and make what does it make orange so you take equal parts of red and equal parts of yellow and you'll get orange. Let's do it. Red, yellow, it's orange. You did it. You made the magic happen. Okay, now we're gonna go around the color wheel. We're gonna go in between the yellow and the blue. What do we get when we mix yellow and blue together? If you said green, you're right. are going to take a little bit of blue blue and yellow we're gonna put it right in between these two colors because this is what happens when you mix them together and a little bit of yellow here it goes boys and girls here's the magic See it? Okay, now from our three primary colors, we have three secondary colors. We mixed our primary colors together and we got three secondary colors. Let's go over. We started with red, yellow, and blue, which are the primary colors. And we mixed red and yellow and got orange, which is a secondary color. 
Then we mixed yellow and blue and we got green, which is the secondary color. Then we mixed primary blue and primary red and we got purple, which is the third secondary color. So red is primary, yellow is primary, and blue is primary. Orange is secondary, green is secondary, and purple is secondary. Next up, we're going to do the tertiary colors. Woo, that's a big word. It's these spaces where we're gonna start mixing the primary and the secondary colors together. So in between red and orange, there'll be red-orange. Stay tuned. 